Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and in today's video, let us talk about the combination PCMB, why you should be taking it and how you can manage it. This video is aimed at all those students who are wishing to take up PCMB in 11th and 12th and do not know if they're taking the right decision or for the students who are currently pursuing the same and want some help with how to manage the same. Firstly, I would like to remove the whole perception of people taking PCMB because they don't know if they want to become an engineer or a doctor because honestly, they are not the only two careers that are present in this world right now. The only reason you should be taking PCMB is when you're confused if you need to read bio for whatever you're planning in the future. So let me explain it to you in a better way. I took PCMB because I was confused if I actually wanted to become a doctor. So just in case I changed my mind sometime in between 11th and 12th, I always had math as a backup option that could help me look into further many other career options. I took PCMB because I wasn't sure if I actually wanted to become a doctor. I didn't want to regret not taking math later because taking math would improve the range of career options I would have later if I decided not to become a doctor. To resolve this confusion about PCMB, let's look at this case. Suppose you want to become something which does not exactly require pure biology, but it's on the lines of biology, for example, biomedical engineering. It is not necessary for you to take the extra burden of PCMB. You can simply go with PCM. Now, when we talk about pure bio, that is career options such as medicine, veterinary sciences, etc., which require you to study bio of 11th and 12th and give exams related to it, that is when you have to look for PCMB or PCB. And now for the students who don't exactly need anything to do with bio, but who just want to learn bio for the sake of it, for knowledge purposes, then go ahead as long as you know that you can manage it well. So if you feel like you can't, then just go with PCM and read whatever you want at your own pace. But if you're a student like me who's completely interested in life sciences, but still wants to keep your career options open, then go for PCMB. In fact, by taking math, it's going to definitely help you with your physics and other aspects. The most important question is managing PCMB. In this case, I usually suggest people to figure out what they actually want to do in between 11th grade. For example, me in between 11th grade, I decided that I wanted to do core biology and go and become a doctor. So that's when I completely shifted my focus to bio. That doesn't mean I left math. I definitely did math, but I did it just as another subject, just like English. So once you decide your core subject, it becomes way, way, way more easier for you to focus properly on what you want to do and side by side do the other subject too. If you're like me and you've suddenly decided that you want to pursue core biology and become a doctor or something in those lines, then that's when you have to decide how to manage math. So math as a subject, what I did was paying attention in class, doing all the sums that my teacher gave me, spending at least one hour or two hours a day dedicated to math and practicing math and being consistent. That means I made sure that I read for each and every small test so that I'm not burdened with math at the end of the big exam. I wasn't an excellent student at math and you don't have to do it too. You can just be decent at that subject which you sidelined and you focused on bio instead. So I consistently tried scoring 90 plus in math and focused on bio and tried getting full in bio. Secondly, change your perspective. Do not look at it as a burden. It's something that you chose. Okay, you chose that path, then go through it. It's just a bit of extra effort. Once you put that effort, everything becomes really, really smooth. If this helps, PCMB is kind of overrated. You can easily manage it with good discipline and good study timings. It is obviously good to get a good clarity if you want to go for pure bio or pure math. But if you're confused, then don't think twice. Go for PCMB. It's going to be easy. You just have to focus on one subject and do the other subject at the same time. That's all. 
some point in your 11th and 12th, as you go through those subjects again and again, you will realize what your real interest is and where it lies in. And that's when you can just shift your focus and do so. If you need help in fixing a good timetable for every day and manage PCMB, then do let me know in the comment section below. I will definitely help you making a timetable. So yes, thank you so much for watching this video. I will be coming up with a few more educational videos soon. So yes, keep watching.